Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play More. Fire Emblem, Path of Radiance. So we are pretty much done with this chapter. For the most part. Oh yeah, Mai's the one that's going to be down there. Is we still got ten turns uh, to serve. Well, not, we've been through like seven turns already. It's ten turns altogether. So, all right, and we're on turn eight now. So let's give this a shot, shall we? Take the shot. Ooh. Oh yeah. And Boyd. Take this guy out. isn't turning out that great either. I say that now, but uh I think she's not doing that bad actually. Okay, who needs a heal? Boy does. I will be able to reach him though. Not if I do this though. <laughs> it's a convoluted way to heal up Boyd, but and I mean he can still get hit, obviously. Oops. Sauron needs to stay at Ike's side here. Get their support up. And this will heal up Nephany for some experience. Double up. 17. There. Now he won't be able to target uh, Boyd. Er, Rice, rather. Rice? Anyways. Alrighty. Be able to Let's give it a try. Nice. You know, let's just have her stay with Gatry there. Thank <laughs> you. 
technically we could end the chapter right now, can we? No, we could. Because we have to take ten turns. That's the condition, uh, the win condition. We can't just route the enemy. We'll just have my take this guy out right now. Is that it? Yes, that's it. What vexatious wretches! I am overmatched. I can't believe I'm saying this, but there's another white heron. R retreat! Leave them their prize. See, now I'm going to be wondering if I hadn't killed that guy, if more reinforcements would have come on the last turn. <sighs> oh well. Last Duke Tennis has escaped again. Like, perhaps trying to fight with that heron on your back is not the wisest of ideas. Why don't we take her to the Apostle before moving on? We finally got Duke Tennis on the run. I don't intend to stop until we've captured or killed that monster. I understand, but shouldn't we at least let someone else carry the heron? Wow. Ike is ready to just straight up murder. Well, I mean... <laughs> Sure, Ducanus is a, a vile, disgusting man, and he's just kept slaves, and... I mean... Uh, it's... A lot of... Debate to be had there, that's for sure. I mean, due process... There's something to be said for due process, you know? You're not just one judge, jury, and executioner. Which is kind of sad. Get that a lot of companies get to police themselves but no checks and balances there that's a viewpoint for another day though <laughs> truth be told she's unbelievably light I barely know she's there is that so I think she weighs oh, I'd say about half as much as miss wow I'm surprised wait you're not what would you say, uh, offended that I just said you, well, he didn't mean that she's heavy, obviously. He meant to say that the heron's light, not that mist is heavy, but I'll bet you are. Oh, what are you grinning about, Boyd? Oh, nothing. I'm just amazed. Did you know you're two times heavier than she is? Oh, there he goes. Glad I don't have to carry you around. I feel like wearing an extra suit of armor. You pig! You're the worst! Ooh! Well, he deserved it. <laughs> Boyd, don't be stupid. <laughs> Alright, maybe I exaggerated a bit. She's still lighter than you. Oh, what do you expect? She's a bird! <laughs> they have to be light in order to fly, obviously. Burns are noted for having hollow bones. Commander, if this battle is going to continue, I think we should get more reinforcements. I mean, humans have uh, n not hollow bones per se, but there is, uh, how, how would you say it, kind of like tubes, not tubes, but it's like holes. Alright, we can go on to the next chapter now. Avoiding those human scum costs me time. I almost made it to the altar. Ryson, are you well? Tavarn, how did you... Nialucci told us everything. Oh, uh, allow me to apologize. I left on my own without a word to you. This is what happened. As long as you're unharmed, all is well. well let's go home. Please, give me a little time. I cannot allow these humans to remain in the forest. I understand how you feel, but we're completely outnumbered. Now let us wait for another day. Once I stand at the altar, I can take care of them. Every one of them. 
you can't mean. Are you thinking of using the forbidden magic? Yes, I will sing those monsters the dirge of ruin. Are you mad? You mustn't. I can't allow it. With permission or without, I do what I must. It is retribution for genocide. Retribution for this forest. I said, you must not let yourself be ruled by despair. Each member of the Heron tribe is an embodiment of balance. Do this and you warp your very existence. That's what they all said. My family, my tribe, and then they died. The humans were drunk with joy. They laughed, they sang, and then they slaughtered us like livestock. My mother, my brother, my elder sisters, even my infant sister, Leanne, all killed in a single night. Ryson, I know that this thing I intend to do brings dishonor to my house, and yet I cannot forgive. And their past actions weren't enough. Now they violate the sanctity of the forest without a trace of regret. Cursed humans. I will never forgive them. Do you think we understand that? That's right. Prince Ryson, there's no need for you to reject your honor based on the likes of them. The tragedy of the herons. The honor, the horror and pain of that night lives on in all of us. Let's return to Phrenesis and think of a plan. You're right. This will not stand. The full power of the Hawk Nation is behind you. The humans will pay. As you wish. Enough already! Lay down your arms and surrender. We will let you live. Wait a minute. Didn't Dyke just say he would kill him if he needed to? Anyways. No, never. I'm not giving up. I'm not finished yet. Out of my way, penniless wretches. Your very existence is an insult to all that is beautiful. All you really want is my wealth and beauty. Miserable curs. You'll reek of poverty and envy. Oh, I understand your emotions. Yes, I do. How could these sad vagabonds not want to be me? It's the last thing in the world. Silence. I am not one to be daunted by means by mean beggars such as you. Oh, ho, ho. In the name of the goddess, I, Oliver, Duke of Tenas, will smite your hideous evil. Um, to arms, to arms, defend me with all your strength, all the strength you possess. Oh, and bring me the little bird, the blue-haired loud is carrying while you're at it. Oh, please. Come on, man. Here they come. Combat formation, everyone. Okay. And we get more reinforcements. Who should we bring? I was thinking of switching Rolf or Leanne or Ziark. Um, but I think this is good. Uh, what items will they have? Okay, they, they do have items. Alright, let's do this. Okay. Alright, well actually, I think I'm going to stop it here for now. We will continue this next time. Godspeed, stay frosty, guys! See ya!